Hola fieras, I am Fiera and I am here today to bring you a reading with a message from the ancestors. Um, this reading is for March but it may resonate to you later and take it as it resonates to you, ok? Cuando sea que ven este mensaje, si les suena entonces es porque el mensaje es para ustedes. Ok, pues, um, este mensaje is really important to me because in marzo we're going to have a very important date, um, March 3rd, 2019. It's uh, day three in the month three of the year three. And 333, three, three, to me, that's a, a number of the ancestors and a very important message that they want to give us. So I thought I would ask to see what message I can share with all of you. So the message that I got from them was this things are going to happen in your favor for you okay if you're trying to create something whether it's a business or you're trying to establish a relationship anything that you are trying to create it's gonna go in your favor okay but there's things that need to fall off of your energy of your habits before they can this can happen so the will of fortune is got, it's moving in your favor and this tower that's here it's here to like i said help you let go of anything that you that you don't need and in this case there's a lot of bad energy like that is keeping you from creating and from going after your goals and your dreams so the tower moment whatever it is that's going to shake you it's here so that that falls off so that you can move forward um para que sigas tus sueños de crear whatever it is that you're trying to create, okay? So whatever is coming to shake you, it's going to be hard for you, and it's really going to destabilize you. And the universe is telling you that even though it's going gonna, it's gonna to destabilize you and make you feel like things are not going your way, it, the universe and the ancestors want you to remember that it is for your own good, okay? Because when we're trying to change our habits and to do better for ourselves, it's not always easy. So it's important for you to remember that even if in the moment it doesn't feel right, it feels like you're going to be thrown down and then you're being kicked down when you're already down. Um, the universe and the ancestors are telling you that that is for your own good. It's supposed to happen. Okay. But here we have the strength card and that is here to remind you that you have the strength to overcome whatever obstacle you have okay if you can see this strength card it's un luchador and it's actually fighting the feathered serpent Quetzalcoatl. so it's telling you that you need to remember where you come from i i am mexican-american and so i always feel like it's important for me to remember that i come from from legend you know i am the descendant of gods and and goddesses that are so powerful and warriors and every time i remember that it gives me that energy that i need to keep going so i think that the universe and the ancestors want you to remember that that you come from from magic okay and that if anyone has the strength to overcome these obstacles is you so always remember that and if you're able to to remember that and to channel that energy so that you can keep going through these obstacles then you are going to have the beginning that you want. And it's a, the Ace of Wands is a new beginning of passion. So it tells me that whatever you, you're, you're working for, that whatever you're trying to create really ignites that spark, you know, that fire in you to keep going. So the universe and the ancestors are telling you, keep going, you can. Okay, if anyone can do it, it's going to be you. Okay. So we also have the Ace of Cups, and that tells me that whatever it is that you're creating, that you're trying to get, you're trying to achieve, is it's something that not only you're passionate about, but something that you feel inside of you, that really fills you with love, with, with that drive to go forward, okay? So again, if you're able to channel all that, all, the, all, all that energy, and remember that you can conquer all these obstacles, then you're gonna get back to yourself, to being yourself, and you're gonna be stronger because of it, okay? But this 10 of Wands right here, it's again telling us that it's not gonna be easy, okay? It's not gonna be easy for you to get that beginning, 
it's not going to be easy for you to be strong, but you can, okay? Nothing good comes easy. Like they say, el que quiera azul celeste, que le cueste. And so in reality, anything that you really want, if you really want it, si te va a costar, but you can have it, okay? So that's good. That's, that's a really good message. So, again, uh, the overall energy of the reading is that the ancestors are trying to wake you up. You know, with that tower moment that you're going to have, it's like a wake-up call from the universe. And that is to balance you, to bring justice to you. Because maybe you have been down, maybe you have been downing yourself, maybe you stopped believing in yourself, in your dream for a while, and the universe needs to make justice of that. It needs to make it right. Okay? So they're going to throw out all the bad energy that you've had around you that's been keeping you from going forward. And only that is what's going to help you to get what you want. Okay? So again, when things are not going your way, when you really feel like you're down, know that the universe is doing this so that you can get out of whatever funk it is you want, you were in. And again, it's not going to be easy, but you can get through it, okay? Now, a special message that I got is that remember that every time that you're going to, you try to do something that's really going to be great, it's not, it's not going to go 100% perfect the first time you try it, okay? But see, this is the Ace of Pentacles, and that is abundance on every level, that the universe wants to give you okay and this if you look at this card this is the four of pentacles i i think that the universe here is telling you the ancestors are telling you hold on to your dreams like the treasure that they are and if one thing doesn't go like the way you want it then try a different way and if that doesn't work then try another way See this person, she's moving the the parts in her in her game, however it is that, that she needs to, until it's perfect, until it is what she wants. And that's what the universe is asking you to do. To try whatever ways you need to try, any different way, you, you gotta change something, change it, try again, because then you're gonna have this pen, ten, ten of pentacles. And ten of pentacles is abundance as well. So I'm really feeling that if this is about a business that you're trying to create, the universe is telling you don't give up, okay? It's not going to be easy. I think that that's been clear in this message and this reading today. But if you are able to keep going, you're going to get what you want. It's going to happen. Because this, this is the Page of Cups. And as soon as that, as that card came out, I thought, it's like... Cuando plantas el maíz, you know, the, the seed is already planted and something new is going to be born. And that's what you're doing. You're creating something new, something maybe that has never been seen. Because remember that even if some people have an idea just like the one you have, nobody's ever going to do anything just like you can do it because only you can do that. OK, that's the gift the universe has given you your own way of seeing things, of doing things, and of creating. So don't let that go. That's really important. So the guidance that we got from the ancestors today is that we haven't yet decided on, on the, the path that we're going to take. We haven't we don't know it. it's like we don't know how to take it yet see the hanged man right here like it's like the head and the body are disconnected you haven't made the connection yet on on how to move forward but the universe is asking you to try to keep thinking about how to make it happen maybe there's a lot of possibilities that you can take maybe you know you haven't decided on how because here this card tells me that you've been in your head about it you've been in your feelings about it and you haven't been able to decide how to make it work okay but the universe is asking you the ancestors are encouraging you to make that decision it's not going to be perfect the first time that you try okay but you gotta start somewhere 
And as soon as you make the decision to start, then you're just going to go forward nonstop. Because you're going to take this message and you're going to say, you know what? It didn't work this time. So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to change things until they work, until they feel right to me. And that's what the ancestors want you to do. Okay? The moment that you decide that you want to begin is the moment that you're going to go ahead and do it. And you're not going to stop until it happens. Okay? The universe is telling you that you have what it takes. The ancestors are reminding you of who you are and where you come from. And the moment that you realize that, you'll realize how powerful you are. And that nobody can stop you. Only you can stop you. Okay? So this is the message for March. Remember, 333, the ancestors are with you. The ancestors are ancestors Azteca, Mexica, Maya. They're with you. And they're, you know, te están echando porras because they want you to get it done. They want you to be the greatest version of yourself that you can be. So remember that you are magic. You come from warriors. You come from legend. You come from deities that were so powerful. And they never let themselves be down. They never let themselves be defeated. Okay? So don't get defeated. Don't allow any doubts to get the best of you. Keep going. Orale fieras. I hope that this message resonated. Ahí me dejan saber. And we'll connect soon again. Thank you.